Hello again. As it's been a very long time since I've uploaded any Hero Quest stuff. So here is an update. Down in the description box you'll get a link for the digital version of the Empire's Last Gleeman. And of course the custom card expansion cards that I have done. And if uh, you want an update on the, everything that's in there. Here we go. So all the heroes, they've got different version card backs. Um, we have allies and familiars. Pretty sure I did update the three card backs. Oh, oh well. Let me get to that in another time. So, barbarian skills for the male and female. White spell set. Uh, Bloodborne. And that. Commander the Guardian Knights. Seen as a uh, super expensive to buy on eBay. Um, don't have to worry about the cards. They're here. Got a spell by O'Dannon updated to 20, 21 version of your quest. The Divine spell set by O'Dannon updated to 2021. So quite a few cards in there. Uh, the um, Zargon skill. This is for my updated. This is for my own version of uh, what are they call Devil Power cards. So my enhanced spell, enhanced spells basically. So a couple of them. Uh, epic encounters. These are five expansions. Uh, familiar spell set. I did these before even the animal islands came out, so they're, they're there. If anyone wants to use them, Final Fantasy name characters for uh, Hero Quest. Little expansion thing here. So you draw this from the treasure deck, and you can get the monster variants to come invade the uh, the dungeon. And these include a huge list of magic that they use in Film Fantasy. So you can mix them up. They still will have the card back on them, or you can change them to the uh, artifact ones if you prefer. It's really up to you. Uh, let's see. Fighter skill. Which is just tied us, it's just a joke. It's just a joke. Wodanon's Fimmer, Fimmer Magic updated. Swiper so go in My power, evil power cards. Which uh, just makes the game so much more difficult. After a couple of expansions, the game is still way too easy. And these cards. I'm made pretty sure you're gonna die. Fun times, yes. This is my own version of the the evil power cards. These are not a Danon's uh, insane. Uh, how do you pronounce that? Sejen, Sejen's cards from the end. This is uh, what I call the third tier, and uh, it's a very hard version. Uh, my uh, holy spells, I think I got from Wes that uh, I've updated to twenty twenty one. I'm pretty sure they sent them to me. And then let's see some of the card backs. Me and Stacey's custom miniatures that I ever made for the Anjak Warrior and Paladin. And uh, our familiars. And here's my own Major Canis, is another set I've made, basically from Binding at Isaac. And yeah, these are awesome. These are a lot of fun, these cards. I spell set. 
uh, what's the word here? What else is in here? Uh, Major the Mirror, uh, Ogre with 10 hit points and Sinestro because the card wasn't dropped in with the expansion which was a real shame. Missed opportunity. We've got the Mimic card set and the rule set. It's a lot of fun. Uh, myth Monsters and there is a ton of these cards that I made and it took me months to do these ones specifically in a certain way that would uh, that would work very well so that is I can't even remember the body name of them all the different tiers of enemies and there's so many of them and I am still waiting for the miniatures to arrive wherever they may be anybody that backed myth journeyman I'm still waiting and I've had this for like eight years or something now, maybe maybe six and uh, I've never been able to play them because everything isn't here. We're still waiting. It's just as bad as fucking Sue Quest. Where's that fucking game? Right, so uh, these are all items. Artifact items for beating the bosses. We've got equipment cards here. If my laptop has the ability to load up anything, thank you very much. So it's uh, 173, quite a few. And uh, some additional potions. And some treasures. Some good, some bad, some might just kill you immediately, so you only be careful with those if you're going to use them. And uh, monster generator sheet, this is uh, something I've added to expand every single quest type. What was this one? Necromancy spells? I think these are new ones that I did. Uh, yeah, these are my own versions. And um, I think we should have just put these as dread spells. I guess I can still change this. Uh, but obviously I've already printed them out. So if you want to use these for that, then for dread spells, that's fine, I guess. So these have a few artifacts in here, a couple of items, and other, some more weapons, and more treasure, and a lot of mimic traps, and the, the nothing. The only card that wasn't transferred over to 2021, I don't know why, so it was strange, but it's here, it's there. You can use it. Uh, potions by Sejen, I'm sure it was. Uh, I've got a wood lamb, but I've got new ones that I've done. The rook here, uh, I've got corrupt versions of this hero, which is another rule set I use. Audio! Runic spells updated to 2021 by O'Dannon. And these frozen horror cards, which are updated. I'm stuck in this folder for easy printing. Witcher card uh, skills and magic. So quite a few stuff in there. I think Siri should be in here as well, is she? Updated monster cards. There she is. So yeah, there's quite a few in here. Quite a few that I'm using. And of course we've got the Witch Lord and Venom in here as well that I've put in here. Well, the wizard set with two eyes for some reason, I've only just noticed that. Um, quite handy. And what is this again? All oh right, my custom quest card, right? We'll get to that later in the glare. Well, okay, so. Links to my quest is updated and all those cards is in a link as well. If you have any trouble downloading them, let me know and I'll upload them to another site so you can download them. Uh, right, so as for all the individual quests I already made, Swiper, Weeched, Demon, so all of these individual quests I'm going to be updating. So we've got this one, we've got the Sea of Claws. Yep, 
yeah, we've got all this. We've got this. I think this was the last key request update that I had on here. Uh, so that, that one. Where else? What, what is the other ones? Uh, we've got the. Ancient Team of the Guardians. Everything that was on its I.O. before I took them all down. These will all be updated in my in the expansion that I'm doing. And what else? There's a good list about this list. So. <laughs> Maybe not this one. The Sleeping Man, the Savoyum, Chantel, and whatever that says. So all of these one shot quests I did, these will be put into... I think that is actually all of them. Well, there it is, I've been looking for this. I need that quest printed out. Uh, these will all be implemented in this. So this is the one I've been working on for a good few weeks now. And this is basically a massive campaign on a continent. And everything is going to be in here. So I've already marked everything down. Everything's marked off. A, a dungeon is locked. It's got a key in it, which you must go to another area to unlock it. Well, to get the key to unlock a dungeon, rather. So it's quite large. It's quite large, and it's taking quite a while to write. And uh, I'm still thinking whether or not to use this one map or use a regular, smaller Hero Quest dungeon map for the, the single dungeons. But for the uh, quests that are larger than one, I'll be using my own uh, dungeon map for that. Uh, so yeah, we've got, we've got everything in here done. And uh, that reminds me as well, there will also be a link to the Alchemist Enigma. This is the Halloween <coughs> the Halloween map that I did a few days ago. This is just a draft. This will also be in the, uh, the my new expansion book. So let's go to the top. Quest expansion, the Alchemist Enigma, the Nightmarish Double Quest. That's right, Swiper, send the son of your people. Uh, start the quest treasure. So here's a quick rundown. And it's all about shape shifters. Little demons. Quite a few puzzles in there. Two quests. That's it. Definitely got to be simple. Who are you calling for? The fucking cat god. There we go. We've got anomaly, aberration, and muscle shapeshifter. And we have just a small amount of uh, crafting to do in the game. This is to find a next Tyson bomb to kill the enemy and then the user shut up! <laughs> Piper, where are you hiding? Can you hear you howling like a banshee? Where are you? Uh, actually, I might just put this into the uh, the judge belt. What are you hiding behind there for? What's the demon? Piper! I may put this into the, the new dread spell set, so I don't forget about it. Uh, right, and if you can move, that would be fantastic. Can I move you? No, no, okay. Right, so that's a bit annoying and useless at the same time. Uh, right, new cards. <sighs> I've spent all day updating all these cards, and... Um, I think I'm just about ready with all of these. Right, so we've got a magical glaive for the artifact. It's barely any actually. Dread spells. There is 21 new dread spells. So I'll quickly go through them. Prepare to pause if you want to read them. Uh, so we've got the Bikecaster's Benediction. 
Charm of Deception, which may only be cast on mercenaries and animal allies instead of just regular heroes. Crows of Sinkhole, Dual Blast, Enigmatic Ensnarement, Ethereal Jaunt, Juggernaut, Magical Pit, Neurotic Warp, and I think there's another version there. Petrifying Gaze, Shadowbind, Shadow Maelstrom, Soul Burned, Soul Leech, Spectral Chains, Spectral Phalanx, Summon Dryads, Twisted Abominations, which summons two Abominations, that kind of effect, Unholy Sacrifice, Venomous Cyclone, Void Tendrils. Okay. And let's go to the other one. We've got some Elden Ring stuff here from the Kickstarter. I'll get to that very soon. Empire Last Gleaming cards. We've got the Classic and the 21 versions. Hero Skills. Uh, oh, Danon's got a ton of these up on his website. Uh, I've only done a few here. Um, so definitely recommend going on to Danon's website and downloading the entire set of cards because they're pretty awesome they're pretty awesome got some miscellaneous cards here i think these are just joke ones that i've done <laughs> forgot about this <laughs> yeah yeah What's next? One monster card so far. Uh, update potion. We've got a pan panacea elixir, or however you meant to pronounce that. You could use it six times. Uh, it's got six uses, and then it's it's gone. So if you want to uh, cure yourself of all these illnesses and afflictions, a panacea elixir is for you. Right. Back on. Uh, random loot deck. I'm going to read these. This is for one of my other quests that I've been doing. So we've got the Rise of the Dreadmen. I've got Corrupt Knight updated. And this could be added to the enemy list once they are spawned using the uh, Lizard Gun thing. I've got a Wall of Ice spell, but this one, I, I just noticed, was already in the frozen horror but this one only works in corridors so I'm just still going to keep it there this monster thing uh, the Paladorian this was with the uh, Mockborg Kickstarter this figure um, so I had to make a character, a monster and a skill set for this one character uh, Superman is a full Manchu expansion single quest I did. It's basically Resident Evil 4. Starting area. Treasures! Loads of treasures! Absolutely loads of them. And we've got one trader. I'm going to update this because I hate this app. Uh, I will get to that and you'll see the updated version once I am ready to upload it. So, we've got a Chained Merc, a Deep Chasm, a Dread Sorcerer, a Hidden Surprise, an Eerie Dread, an Arc Warboss, an Unknown Key, Armory, a Secret Door, a Small Box, a Treasure Chest, Crumbling Floor, Crystal Skull, I think this is one version that my weight measured it. Uh, so let's see, damage equipment, death flashes before you, this is another random stupid card I did. Discarded equipment, Dread Warrior Ambush, because we don't get enough Dread Warriors in the, uh, the quests I've noticed. Fallen Rocks, Forbidden Siren, Large Chest, Lurking Gargoyle, Enchanted Gargoyle, Magical Trap, Monkey Hands, 
Oh, this is one. I think this is the one busted. Mysterious figure. <laughs> Mystical Ren pickpocket. Pushing up the ethereal. Walk through any walk a single time. Right, I'm going to have to fucking update that. I just noticed that. You find a bottle with a thick purple sludge inside, consuming its contents will allow you for a short time to become transparent, allowing you to walk through any bowl a single time. Right. Right, wait a minute. Let's cut that. No, that was a bit ridiculous. I didn't even notice that. Uh, what was that? He request work. He request card collection. Right, let's take the screen off because it's annoying me. I can't see. You find a bottle with a thick purple sludge inside. Consume its contents on you for a short time. through any walk. <laughs> okay then. Well we need to walk through any wall. Fuck you, stupid thing. Walk through any wall. A single time. I don't know if I missed that. We turn this card to the bottom of the deck. We turn this card to the bottom of the deck. You find a, pearl, you find a bottle with a thick purple sludge inside consuming its contents so we allow you for a short time to become transparent allowing you to walk through any wall a single time we turn this card to the bottom of the deck okay that's good walk through any wall try this so so the shit that i've got to work through right uh i think that was a treasure card wasn't it Ocean of the Ethereal. Yeah, boy. Save that, you dick. And then uh, we can just get rid of this. Cause that's just garbage. Ocean of the Ethereal. Sweet, we are done. We're done with that. Right. Let's go back to Trash Cards. Right, where was that? Right. Okay. 
pushing up the ethereal. You find the bottle with a thick purple sludge inside, consuming its contents, slowly for a short time to come transparent. <coughs> Allowing you to walk through any wall a single time. Return this card to the bottom of the deck. Shield of Resolute Radiance. This gives you a plus one to defense for the duration of the quest. A spear trap. Just a trap. Spell scroll. Um, a random spell scroll is found. Teutonic Carapace. Uh, will grant you protection from three points worth of damage. Teleport trap. The hunt begins. Four corrupt heroes chase you. Any four random ones? We've got the meowling. You just randomly stand on a cat and it's like, fuck you, sound go. The rogue's curse, right? I think this was the one that I did. This is a version I did. And uh, this is the other one, the other version that I did with this card art. And the undead guardians, you know dice and it will tell you how many will invade trick or treat the halloween card so let's take a chance with the little friend on this halloween night that never ends goblin stands and spirits play with the story you find this way so you roll a single dice and you will get this what else we've got tripwire wandering monster but what's the wandering monster things uh wandering monster again um, wandering Yetis. I think that's it, that's the last one. So this is all the set that I've got so far. And um what is it? I've got these cards to update as well. So these alchemy things that were uh, brought in on Rise of the Dreadmen. I'm going to be expanding that quite a lot for uh, what is it? For my new quest. For my new quest back. So I, to be honest, I don't know how long this is going to take to do. I've still not even written everything out for uh, the draft. But I'll get there eventually. Um, I'm definitely just going to put everything into this. It's going to save a lot of time. The only thing that won't be in there is the uh, the Empire's was going in. And this still takes place right at the very end of every single adventure. Like uh, every quest book that's released by Avalon Hill and all that. Because it's going to be quite difficult. Definitely not recommended to do the Empire's Last Greenman straight after the core box because um, I'm pretty sure that means a quick death. I mean, the amount of monsters on these quests are quite tough. Um, I think... Oh, I didn't. Oh, I did, yeah. I'll need to change this as well. But, yeah, whatever. I can just update it to the 2021 version of the book and add the uh, the extra stuff on there once I get a much better site to use to upload all my all my uh, work on. Um, yeah, so links below for all these updated cards and for the this quest and the fourth set of card collection that I'm doing that will be up very soon, very very soon.